found an install today. Um, it's not a big one. Um, just a little Jayco journey with a little lithium conversion. Um, pulling out his old batteries, putting in a um, uh, one of our Chevy 100 amp hours. Um, so yeah, just a little one. Hopefully get it done in a day and a half a bit. Look busy, Craig. That's pretty well me done, eh? I'm just ready for my battery now. Battery will go there, and it's own holster onto the floor. Bob Jackal. The beard. What? Here's the beard. Oh, oh, f***. Oh. washed off. What? what happened to your hair? <laughs> 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 it went long ago, mate. It went long ago. <laughs> Um, we don't have enough room up on the roof to fit another 130 next to the other one, existing 130 up there, so... We're going to sit a different size panel up there, see how it sits. Um, if it looks like it fits alright without sitting over anything or getting shaded or anything like that, we'll roll with that. Otherwise, the panel on the rear looks really old. We might discuss with the customer perhaps removing it and putting a much larger one in place of it. So, we'll see what he comes up with anyway. Final update on this job, we've decided to go with the 30 amp regulator, 130 watt narrow solar panel. Customer should be laughing by the time we're finished. Awesome. Is that the first job of the day done? Yeah mate, just a little solar upgrade there. I think Ryan just added another 130. He just um, need a little bit more solar up there, so we just just fit another 130 out there for him, so yeah. Oh, just a silver line with another big power system going in it, mate, yeah. Who's yours? Anything specific? Anything interesting about it? Just, um, just trying to leave room for the customer's beer, which is the, the most important thing. Working, mate. Work. Got the last couple of connections on the expedition box for Donor of King Shocks or Shocks to Shocks Distributor, I should say. Hey, Ben, I don't think he plans on putting this on his roof. Put mine on his roof. I'm rolling it over. He wants to be able to read that. Look at the thing you're putting on. You would think with my head this close to it that I'd be able to put it on the right way. Um, but uh, apparently, no, I couldn't. So I have this thing upside down, I'm just flipping it, over, flipping it over. I'll just quickly do a final check and make sure the brake is tripped um, with an earth bolt, and that's it. Great. It's on to the next one.